self-care to me is doing all of those little things that you usually don't really think about or maybe you forget them or maybe you don't have time for them it's just those things that make you like really make you feel great about yourself and make you feel like a boss and like you can conquer the world and everyone just needs a self-care day every now and then because we all deserve it <laughs> what's up everybody it's georgina welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i am going to have a little pamper day and take you guys with me of course i don't know if you guys hear my voice but i'm kind of like a little bit sick um i just had like the worst cold ever don't have covid just like a really bad cold um and yeah i just felt like having a pamper day haven't had one in a really long time and i'm just really in for the best pamper day ever good morning oh my gosh my voice <clears throat> um i woke up this morning at six it's now eight so i was just like laying in bed for like two hours but it's fine because i needed it you know falls under self-care um i'm going to take a shower I don't know if you guys can hear my voice, but my throat is literally like... For some reason, I've never been more excited to take a shower. <laughs> Going to make some breakfast now. I'm just putting the oven to temperature. And I have my bagel right here <laughs> that I'm gonna put in the oven. Like, that's literally my favorite breakfast ever. It's just um, bagel with avocado and like vegan cream cheese. It's the best. Let me introduce you to the best breakfast ever bagel, avocado, um, vegan cream cheese, raspberries topped with a shit ton of like spices. I was just drinking my green juice and I got it all over my sweater right here and then also right here like I'm such a klutz but not to worry my favorite brand that does loungewear is here to save the day you know picking out new clothes shopping wearing cute clothes looking cute it's all part of self-care and today I'm gonna start off the video by showing you guys some of my new favorite um loungewear outfits like comfortable outfits from lounge underwear i have them all in this huge bag this is the order that i did um at lounge this month and the most important and fun thing is that lounge has the biggest black friday sale ever going on right now starting from um the 15th of november with discounts up to 70 percent off like it's crazy um their products are just like amazing the best quality they have the cutest things so if you want to shop on lounge then this is your time to do so and i'm going to show you guys everything that i got this month from lounge literally the cutest pieces ever so just just watch okay okay you guys i'm gonna show you the first outfit are you ready i don't think you are this is the cutest outfit that i've ever seen okay <laughs> this is the first outfit hold on let me okay so i moved my phone so you guys can see everything better this is the first outfit like isn't this just the cutest outfit ever like it's baby blue it's soft it's velvet and this just makes me want to snuggle up in bed or like on the couch and just be comfy and cozy all day this is the sweater it's kind of like a little bit oversized um this the material that's on the outside is also in the inside i literally hate it when like soft clothes on the outside have different material on the inside no no like i want it to be just as soft okay and then i got these cute little matching shorts they fit so good elastic waistband and ah, oh my gosh i think this is like my fave next up we have this outfit this cute little matching set you can just never go wrong with a matching set. This is what the sweater looks like. And then these are the shorts. These are actually some of my favorite shorts. Um, I have them in a couple of other colors like green 
and black and they're so comfortable like they have a little bit of a thicker waistband they're kind of like boxers but not really they're cycling shorts but they fit like super comfy like boxers if that makes sense i love this color on me i feel like it goes so well with my eyes like doesn't this color really compliment me I think so again i will have the names on the screen right here so it will be super easy for you guys to find this on the lounge website also i have a cute little cheeky underwear set under this outfit from lounge underwear that i'm going to show you guys right now so this is the bra very comfortable i'm gonna come close so you guys can see like the detail of this it's so comfortable it doesn't have like wiring it's super stretchy and then these are the thongs <laughs> i'm just pulling them up real high so you guys can see um but yeah i'm wearing this matching set underneath and it's just so comfy i know that i say comfy a lot but that's just what it is okay i swear this is the perfect outfit for lounging around in your house like this just gives me lazy sunday vibes just woke up gonna chill in my cute sexy little lounge set let me actually get up on the bed so you guys can see the trousers um i'm really short but oh, let me see if i can show this to you this is what the trousers look like i wear everything in a size small by the way from lounge and it fits amazing so yeah, these are what the trousers look like the front and the back and then this is the top just like a cute green little basic tank it has lounge right here on the bottom this is my favorite color by the way you guys know like this is just my all-time favorite color lounge makes your booty look so good like i swear every single every single outfit your ass will look amazing in it last outfit that i have to show you guys but are you kidding me? This is so cute. Hold on, let me get up on my bed again so you guys can really see the shorts. Okay, these are the shorts. <laughs> this is the top. Oh my gosh, I just love this outfit so much. Everything from Lounge is like super like stretchy, by the way. Like pretty much everything that I tried on today has like an elastic waistband. So you never have to worry about it being like too tight on your waist or like around your stomach. Because it always just kind of, like it gives, you know, like it gives more, like it's super stretchy. That's what I'm trying to say. I am just so obsessed with little matching sets like this. And I think this color looks so bomb. It's so cute. Those are all of the outfits. Um, and I actually decided that I'm going to be wearing this the whole day for my little pamper day. I'm going to be lounging around in this set and also the lounge bra like i said before you really don't want to miss out on this year's black friday sale from lounge up to 70 percent off site wide and starts on 15th of november i don't really know what my hair is doing right now but what i do know is that i want to fix this because i just don't really like what's happening here um i slept in a ponytail so i have like the like that awkward ponytail line going on in my hair right now so i i, I want to fix my hair <laughs> let me just dive into my skincare drawer and see what i have or like see what i want to do look at this cute headband i haven't worn it in so long i got this like i don't know like a year ago or something and i've worn it literally twice should i wear it today is that cute i feel like i should wear my hair down with the uh, with the headband Okay, yeah, I think this looks really cute. Look what we have here. This is an eye serum and it comes with those like little uh, like metal thingies that supposed to like deep puff your eyes and when you squeeze it, um, eye cream comes out of it. So, oh, I'm gonna apply some of this and like put that metal thingy underneath my eye. Oh, that does feel kind of nice, like super cooling. I always like go overboard with eye creams and like moisturizers. I put way too much. You know me, I'm always whipping out the eye masks and lip masks. <laughs> I naturally do this every single time. Um, but this just like makes me feel so fancy, like putting on these cute little masks. And I think it looks so like aesthetically pleasing.
Ooh, I have it on my hands. I'm gonna like wipe it on my legs. Maybe my legs will like be super soft <laughs> if I put it on my legs. I gotta finish it off with a lip mask, you know, gotta finish off the whole mask situation. I'm not gonna be able to talk or move my face with um, this on, but you know, we're fine. I can't really talk right now, or well, I shouldn't talk. I'm going to do my eyebrows. It's not perfect, but it does look a little bit better. Okay, I'm gonna take these off because I'm just done with this. <laughs> so annoying not being able to talk, especially when you talk way too much. So shiny and slimy. Ugh, I need like a towel or something. Let's finish off with a serum. I'm gonna use um, this serum for dark spots. And I'm just gonna put a little bit on. I know you're not supposed to let the thing touch your face, but I literally do it all the time. I'm so sorry. <laughs> And I'm using this because I feel like I have like a lot of dark spots on my face from like, like just like uh, pimple scars and everything that are really dark. Like for example, here and here, I had a lot of pimples a couple of years back and I still have dark spots from it. I found my jade roller and I haven't used this in such a long time. So I'm going to use it today. Like last time I used this, it's literally like months ago. I don't freaking know, but I used to use this all the time. <laughs> I told you guys I really want to do something with my hair. I don't know like curl it, style it, whatever. I don't care. I just feel like doing my hair. Um, so I'm going to do my hair and I was thinking, okay, I'm going to use this because I know that it creates like really beautiful waves. And then I saw this in my collection and this is to create those like really tight curls, which I will not be doing today. But I was thinking what will happen when I do like bigger sections? Like, on this tiny curling wand, like, will it give me waves or something? Okay, do we want to see what happens? I'm just going to take, like, this random section from the back. So, if I mess it up, it's not going to be too noticeable. It's, like, a pretty thick section, okay? So, I'm just going to roll it around and see what it does. Should I leave the ends out? Maybe, like, a little bit. Let's see what it looks like. Wait, that actually, hold on, let me, let me move this mirror. Okay, so it's still a really tight curl. It's kind of like awkward and it has like dents in it. I'm not really sure what to think. Let me brush that out. Um, I'm not too sure. Okay, yeah, I don't really know if I like that. I don't think I like that. I think I'm gonna go for the other curling wand. <laughs> Have my other curling wand warming up because I did not like that other one. Um, also, I'm getting so many questions about this lately, but you guys are always asking me to film like a video about my favorite hair tools and like my hair products. So I'm definitely gonna do that. Like just show you guys all my favorite like curling irons and curling wands and everything like that. I'm definitely going to film that video really soon. Okay, let's fix this little piece. See? There we go. Much, much, much better. <laughs> After this, we have the last piece. Ah, freaking burnt my finger almost. Oh, that was so hot. I'm just gonna let this cool in my hand a little bit. There's the curl. Super like big bouncy curl, love that. I don't know if you guys know, but not too long ago, I cut myself like long curtain bangs. I did it myself and for some, <clears throat> 
and for some reason I have like a lot of trouble styling them because I feel like I always have to style them or always curl them for them to look good otherwise like if they're straight they just look awkward if that makes sense gotta get this really close to my face I never know how long to leave it on for because I don't want to fry my bangs off okay I think I'm gonna clip this little piece That looks so dumb, just like one little piece clip. But okay, this is one side done. Now I'm gonna do the other side. Looks so good so far. You know, I gotta do a transition. Both sides done and curled. This is what it looks like. Um, I just did this side, so it's like a little bit tighter on this side. I'm gonna put the clip out of this bang. Okay, that looks kind of strange. Um, I am gonna brush it out, but I think I'm gonna like do something to my face. Maybe put a little bit of makeup on before I brush this out so I can leave these curls to set a little bit longer. You guys know like I always leave my curls to set for a little while because I feel like they like stay in longer if I don't brush them out right away. Okay, I'm gonna put on a little bit of makeup. I'm not really gonna do anything crazy um or anything like that i just always feel a little bit more put together and just better when i'm more bronze i have a little bit of makeup on like i just feel more put together i already said that but <laughs> yeah i'm just putting on some cream contour making my face a little bit more bronze i'm just blending that out with this big brush from morphe i always have like under eye backs like it never really bothers me that much but sometimes you can clearly see that it's like much worse than like some other days and i don't like that because then i just look tired and i hate that i feel like um we need some blusher so i have this one from ColourPop. i don't even know if this will show up on my skin because it's really light but this gives me like kylie jenner vibes you know what i'm talking about like her blush always looks so light and like rosy i don't know how to explain it is it showing up or not maybe if i put a little bit more okay so it's kind of showing up but also not really i'm just whatever <laughs> i'm just gonna go in with this blush it looks pretty good it's just not like dramatic or like heavy or anything i used to put on black liquid liner every single day of my life and then i kind of switched to um you guys know like doing my liner with eyeshadow like doing an eyeshadow wing but today we are switching it up and doing some liquid liner okay here we go i haven't done this in a pretty long time I'm not gonna do like a dramatic wing or anything like that. I'm just gonna do a small tight. Oh, <laughs> I think that's big enough. I'm now going to apply some falsies. By the way, the liner looks pretty good today. Um, of course, I'm gonna be wearing lashes from my own brand, GGB Beauty. You guys probably already know, but I have my own beauty brand and we currently sell vegan and cruelty free lashes. This is in the style Blossom. Um, I've used these before, so I'm just gonna take them off the packaging, put some glue on them. I've literally used, like, this pair over 20 times, and they still look so freaking good. Um, oh, lashes are on. I just finished off my eyes with some brown eyeshadow on the bottom lash line. Like, I literally just go, shh, shh, that's it, and then I put, um bottom lash mascara on now i still need to do my lips and then we'll be finished with this makeup blue i used this um lip liner in my previous makeup tutorial it's ColourPop field day lip liner some of you guys um in the comments told me that it was actually sold out i really hope that it comes back maybe it's already back but this lip liner is so good it's just like the perfect nude like darker nude color charlotte tilbury tripping on love tinted lip stuff i don't even know what this is and we're done now let's brush out my hair because it's been marinating in those clips for a couple of hours 
the curls have already gone down a lot you can see like it's not, like when you use this it's not like super heavy duty curls it's more like a soft wave let's see looks really good super voluminous love these like loose waves it's like a little bit more curled towards the end but like in the um, what's it called up top it's just like more voluminous and bouncy just how i like it i think that this has been a pretty successful pamper day so far i feel really great about myself like really put together and it's just like so nice to take a little bit of time for yourself and just like do all of the things that you love to do also i really need to get my nails done um i called the nail salon last week for an appointment um today is thursday and i have an appointment saturday and i really still want to include that in this video as well um unfortunately i can't go today but what can you do about it but yeah this is what my nails look like right now last time i got this like black french thing going on right here um i love it but i'm just like bored of it like i get bored really fast of like nails that's why i pretty much like all the time just get basic or like plain nails or just like natural or french because i just get really like bored really love how my makeup turned out today by the way my lashes look so good gg beauty um blossom lashes so cute i'm waiting on gelano to get here because i asked him if he wants to take some pictures of me because i'm feeling myself like i got my hair um looking cute my makeup looks cute so i want to take some pictures and um yeah i'll see you guys when i got my nails done because that is the last step of the self-care you know gotta get these claws done so tired of this black french thing okay see you hey guys so today it's saturday and i am going to get my nails done i cannot tell you how excited i am to get these done because i mean i told you guys before in the video but i'm so tired of these but this is the before i gotta say like when i first got them done the black part looked really black but for some reason like the past like week or like two weeks it's been looking blue, like dark blue. Like, do you see this? This does not look black to me. I'm at the nail salon now, and this is again a before. You can see how grown out they are. I love my outfit today, so cute. First, she filed everything off from my old nails, and then I was choosing between these two colors, but I decided to go for the one in the back. I don't really know what color this is. All I know is that it's an acrylic powder and i think these are my favorite nails that i've ever gotten they look so just like classy and pretty and i'm obsessed with this color they're so cute just got my nails done you guys look how cute they are <laughs> here's gelano hey guys do you like my nails yeah they're so pretty they're very beautiful yeah. this is like the most gorgeous color that I've ever gotten. The lighting is kind of weird, but yeah, they are very they beautiful. They don't justify that. How, how they actually look. Yeah. 